Oh, it's Tony here from Paradise Garage. Hey, what's going on? Tony here from Paradise Garage. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So let's just show you what we did. So we got the fan, we got a 24 inch fan. I took out this window, right? And basically mounted the fan in, okay? Um, I hooked it up to a 110 outlet, but I got a little variable speed controller here. Okay, super nice from iPower. All right, plugs right in. It didn't come with a cord, so I had some extra cord laying around, so I just wired it right into the fan there, okay? So when I go in, I just plug it in, and then I could turn it on. It seems like, before I turn it on, before it starts making some noise, it, to me, it seems like it needs more intake, and we're gonna go over there and talk about the intake in just a bit, but I just wanted to kind of turn it on for you. Now lower it. I will lower it and come over here, and we'll show you the intake. So this is my backyard, if you can see. Okay, that's the backyard. And we have fresh, clean air coming in from the backyard. I got a 16 by 25 air filter insert for it with a MERV4 rating. So it's a single ply filter, a lot of airflow. Okay, we're gonna talk more about that. Okay, on this side, you can see the filter. And we're gonna close the other door. So, so this door, check it out, goes into the house, okay? This is the outside. And I'm gonna close the garage door quick as well. Come on, Lonnie, get inside, Lonnie, there we go. So we're gonna close the garage door. Now keep in mind, when we paint, we're gonna clear out most of this stuff in here because right now we're just working on the house, right? And it's messy, but it's this is basically gonna be the spray booth for Paradise Garage, okay? Um, I might even be spraying with this refrigerator here for now, but later on we're gonna clear it out. So. If we take a look at the fan here, I'm going to turn it up all the way, okay? And as I walk to the door, I can feel the air already coming in. A lot of air. You can, you can kind of see it's like really pulling in the air right now. And I feel like I have more room to expand because when I open the door, you can see the fan blades open up for more airflow. If I shut the door, it's restricting. Okay, so I think I'm gonna test it out as is right now, but I do have room and I might, I might cut that open to get more airflow. But that's the overall setup. It's pretty airtight and the exhaust is gonna go right out. Lower it down, and if I shut it, the louvers close, and that's it. So that's pretty much the setup I wanted to share with you so far. We painted the epoxy flooring, uh, we got the black ceiling here, got a little design, you know, on this side. I, I don't think I'm gonna need to expand as far as putting another fan here. This is much more than enough for this little 500 square foot garage. So here, you know, I could put a banner, a poster, I could put, we could put a shelf in there, I don't know, whatever, I just got open space, okay? So that's pretty much it. I wanna say thank you for watching the video, just wanna give you an update and an idea if you're building out your home garage and you're trying to create a spray booth. You know, this is a completely sealed garage. You got fresh air coming in, exhaust going out, and very, very soon you're gonna see exactly how it all works, because we're gonna be filming, we're gonna be painting this little Honda Grom right here. We're gonna be customizing and painting this with a candy color, I'm not sure what color candy, uh, but we're gonna to be totally pimping out this Honda Grom project here, and I think you're gonna love it. So it's Tony here from Paradise Garage, AKA Learn Auto Body and Paint.com. If you wanna learn more about auto body, customize your own cars, do dent repairs, make some extra side money, you know, just maybe fix your friend's cars, whatever. Click here for a free training and seven day video series. 
um, to grab that. And don't forget to subscribe. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this garage here. In the next videos, we're going to talk about air compressor setup and how I set the air compressor up here. So subscribe to the channel and we'll be talking about this next and you're going to see me as we start building some cool projects in here. It's Tony from LABAP VIP right here, Learn Auto Body, right? And uh, thank you for Adam Spray Guns in the background for sponsoring us. You can't really see it, but we're going to have some cool stuff. Talk to you soon. Have a good day. Bye.